What is up guys? I'm Daddy Gamer Fred back again with another Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu, Pokemon Let's Go Eevee, and Pokemon Go news update video. In today's video, we're gonna be talking about Mel Tan's evolution, Mel Metal, which just got announced today with a brand new trailer slash interview between Professor Willow and Professor Oak. They've been having this like bromance relationship over the phone discussing Mel Tan and basically studying Mel Tan. And in this episode, Episode, episode three, which I believe is the season finale, they found out that Meltan can evolve into Mel Metal. Now, this is pretty cool because Meltan is a mythical Pokemon. This makes it the first mythical Pokemon with the ability to evolve. Now, this is coming from the Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee website. It says this is the first time Meltan has been seen in 3,000 years. In ancient times, this Pokemon was worshipped for its power to create metal. And we get some high def images of Meltan, some in-game images of Meltan inside Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee. It says when Meltan evolves into Mel Metal, it grows vastly stronger than before. It body hardens as a result of its evolution and becomes incredibly sturdy. The bulk of his body is made of liquid metal and his arms in particular are very flexible. They can whip forward to deliver devastating punches. Mel Metal's powerful double iron bash now double iron bash is a brand new move into the pokemon games for let's go pikachu and let's go eevee and it looks like it's going to be exclusive to mel metal it says mel metal possesses a unique steel type physical move called double iron bash with this powerful move mel metal uses the hex nut in its chest like an axe to spin its powerful arms around dealing a double strike to the opponent the weight of the heavy hex nuts on its arms combined with its spinning motion gives this move extraordinary power. After it hits, it may even cause the target to flinch. So that's pretty cool. As you can see here with the screenshot in the video provided by the Pokemon company in Cerebi.net, it says the opponent Onyx flitch and cut and move. Also, this move hits two times, which is pretty cool. That means it's going to hit pretty strong two times. Now, moving on. It says evolving Meltan into a Mel Metal. It says it has become clear that Meltan will only evolve into Mel Metal in Pokemon Go. I'm going to be clear and read that again. It says it has become clear that Meltan will only evolve into Mel Metal in Pokemon Go. To evolve it, you will need 400 Meltan candy. I repeat, 400 Meltan candy. So that is going to be the reason why we're going to be able to catch multiple versions of Meltan even though it's a mythical Pokemon and why there are tons of Meltan spawning when you open up this mystery box so you can have enough Meltan so you can reach that 400 Meltan candy threshold which to me is going to be a difficult process regardless of the time period or the time that we're going to have with this mystery box. I believe it's 30 minutes you open it and then Meltan just repeatedly spawns next to you like a lore. While I do think that's going to help players obviously to catch a ton of Meltan, 400 candy these might take you more than one try, obviously. But who knows? We're going to have to see on that. It says, just with the candies you collect for other Pokemon, you'll be able to get Meltan candies by doing things like catching Meltan, sending it to Professor Willow, or having Meltan travel around with you as a buddy Pokemon. You will also be able to get these candies when you send Meltan from Pokemon Go to Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Pokemon Let's Go Eevee. Plus, you'll be also to use some other handy shortcuts to speed up this evolution such as getting more melting candies by trading with your friends or using rare candies to help you along the way but that's pretty cool there's uh, multiple ways to kind of speed up this process but if you play pokemon go you kind of know how this goes with a pokemon that needs tons of candy to evolve think of it like evolving a magic heart into gyarados you need a ton of candy and it is daunting sometimes especially when it's a rare spawn or it doesn't spawn as frequently as you want 
Sunny. It says you can bring Meltan, you evolved, and Pokemon Go to Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Pokemon Let's Go Eevee. You can also have friends send you theirs from their Pokemon Go accounts. Have fun exploring the Kanto region together with Meltan. Now, again, this is pretty cool. We do know that you can use multiple Pokemon Go accounts in order to send Pokemon from Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu into Pokemon Let's Go Eevee. So this is a good thing you might want to start now if you only have one Pokemon Go account. Create another account, you know, get started catching Pokemon, whatever. Also, if you have friends who maybe played Pokemon Go a while ago and, you know, don't play no more, you might want to, you know, convince them into dumping the Pokemon they do have if they're never going to play Pokemon Go again into your game. Because if anything, you could get the candies for them and use that to beefing up your Pokemon. Now, that's going to be it, guys, on that mel metal let me know your thoughts in the comment section below i think it's pretty cool i don't think it looks like the dopest pokemon especially coming after zero or it definitely doesn't look dope but i would say out of the two meltan does look like the better pokemon even though it's just a gray ditto with a fucking nut on top of it this one looks like it's a try hard but at the same time i can understand i like the liquid metal idea but i just uh i don't know some something about about it it's just like it's not clicking with me and then maybe it's because i need to see it in game and have it in my hand you know looking at it with the art style of the game maybe it will grow on me but as of right now it kind of just looks like a sloppy mess let me know your thoughts on mel metal i like i said in the comment section below i answer all comments i'm gonna see you guys in the comment section let's talk about mel metal and your thoughts on how you gotta get mel metal inside of pokemon go first and then trade it over to Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee. To me, that's just kind of weird that there isn't a way inside of the Let's Go games to evolve Meltan alone if you don't have Pokemon Go. I know that is probably hurting a lot of players who don't play Pokemon Go. Let me know if you are one of those players in the comment section below. Like always, peace. I'm gonna see you guys on the next one. Like always, guys, I'm Daddy Gamer Fred on Instagram and Twitter, and you guys can bring the conversation there. I'm the American Gamer in Switzerland right here on YouTube, and yes, I'm going to be doing a ton of videos just like this one. So if you enjoy, please hit that subscribe button. Also, hit the like button. It does help me out a ton as far as growing the channel is concerned. Ring the bell if you want to be notified on the next time I drop a video. Peace. I'm going to see you guys on the next one.